what people usually do is they post an advertisement on Facebook on various UTD groups. You just post your advertisement with your concerns whether you are vegetarian or a non-vegetarian based on whatever your preferences are, smoking, drinking, so on and so forth. You can just post it and you will get response definitely. I would suggest you to have someone not from your department because then you end if you have someone from the same department you end up copying assignments sharing assignments and that may lead to plagiarism which is you know like university takes a strict action on those things so it's always better not to have someone from the same department the lease agreement it's almost non-negotiable prices are always fixed when it comes to apartments and people usually reside uh, not on campus but off campus the rent pretty much comes out at around 400 to 500 if you are like two people in a 1 BHK apartment I used to stay with one more person in a 1 BHK so I was paying around 400 to 500 if you happen to cook yourself you'll just invest some time but you'll also save some bucks I never had to spend on transport because UTD gives you a Comet card which has a dart pass on it so you can travel around the Dallas area for free on all the buses uh, books um, basically the library has all the facilities, all the latest books, all the books you need for the course and for the other things you can always resort to PDFs so that should not be a problem. The differences I noticed between home country, uh, university and UT Dallas is that uh, it's much more practical oriented. Um, you end up doing things on yourself by by yourself and you get a practical exposure to things you get access to a lot of resources a lot of research it's always good to reach around like two weeks before your orientation or at least a week before orientation uh, and get your various blood tests done so UTD has one TV test which happens for every student who comes and enrolls in university so unless you take that TB test you can't enroll for courses so it's always good to you know come a bit early and get your TB test done orientation basically has like two portions one is the UTD orientation and the other is the departmental orientation orientation is pretty important and you get to meet professors, you get to meet your fellow classmates. Usually it's around like 40 students and the minimum goes to around 10-15 students. 80% are Indians, then around 15% are Chinese or Asians and the five remaining 5% 5 are Americans. A lot of my classmates had prior experience, very few were just freshers like me. I never had that time as my program was quite rigorous. So there are pretty much many events which happen in UTD and on campus. A lot of them are by the Indian Students Association and a lot of the others happen by various organizations which reside on campus.